Hey everyone, my name is Paige and in this video today I'm going to be showcasing all of the nine new and exciting features to our mobile app. So let's jump straight into it. The first new feature is the ability to add stock music and video. So now when I do create a new video, I can notice at the top the stock option. And there are a range of stock categories from technology to business, nature and environment and people, anything that you can think of that you'd need for your video. But for this example, I'm going to jump into the fitness category. I'll select the three videos that I want to use. So this one, this one, and this one up at the top. Once they've loaded, I'll hit next. And there they are. I can see them all uploaded here. Now I'm going to add in the stock music by clicking the plus button and then music. And now I can scroll through all of the available stock music. And by clicking on it, it's going to just give me a bit of a preview of what it sounds like. So I'll go through and find the one that I want. And I'm just going to go with this one. I'll click add to video. And now I'll scroll to the very front of my video, hit play. And I'm really happy with that. Next up is changing the aspect ratio. So just head up to the top box here and you can select through any of the options from four by five, 16 by nine. But for this example, I'll choose one by one and my entire video has changed to one by one. Next up is cropping your video. So by simply pinching the screen, you can reposition, zoom or crop your entire video, just like I'm doing now. You can now also rotate your video. So at the very top here, you can see the left and the right rotate button. By clicking them, I can rotate my video any way that I'd like. Now for the first time in ClipChamp iOS, you can slow down or speed up your video from 0.1 to 10x speed. Just click on this button and you can see here I am adjusting my speed. This is super slow and jumping all the way up to 7x, super fast. But just for this video, I will keep it on two times speed and I'll also adjust my other two videos. So this one and this one. And the speed of all my videos has now been adjusted. You can also edit your audio. So by clicking on the little music button here, it's going to bring up this toggle and you can adjust the volume level to whatever you'd like. And it will also change the audio on all of your other videos. So I'll double check that one here, click on the toggle and I can see there it's the same audio. Now we're up to flexible text. So by clicking on the plus button and adding in my text, I'm going to write out 50% off. You can select any of the font options and any of the color options that you'd like. So just scroll through and find the one that will suit your video. Once I'm happy with that, I can move it around anywhere across the whole video, zoom in to rotate, play around with the size. And then finally, I'm just going to put it into place here at the bottom of the video. And there it is. Now the really cool feature of animating text. So by clicking on this button here, I can scroll through the list of animation options until I find the one that I want. And I'll click on that one, play my video back, and there's my animation. Lastly, we can now time the text to our video by clicking this button here. And you can see it's actually across both of these videos, which I don't want it to be. So by dragging back the arrow, I'm going to be placing the text over the first clip only. So when I play that back, I can see the text is only on my first clip. To finish things off, I'm going to continue editing and follow the same processes that I did before and use all of these new features in the rest of my video. So I'll go ahead and I'll add text, animations, I'll rotate and adjust the speed. And I'll also be sure to time all of my text to the correct video. Now the last thing left to do is to export my video. So I'll just click 1080p and that's it done. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, make sure to click on the next video to check out our brand kit walkthrough.